Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today we will be taking a fresh look at a camera that truly stood the test of time. The Panasonic G7. Even though it's been a while since its release, this little powerhouse remains among creators favorite. So let's dive in and find out why the G7 is still an excellent choice for everyone from beginners to professionals in 2024. Let me start with sharing what I absolutely love about this camera, which is the design. The Panasonic G7 boasts a compact design, lightweight body, making it incredibly portable. Wherever you traveling or just catching everyday moments around town, this camera will not wear you down. It's easy to grip, feels comfortable in the hand during extended shoots, which is a huge plus for me. For those long sessions, your wrist, hand will not get tired. That is one of the perks of a micro four thirds camera. One of the standout features of the G7 is its 4K video capability. It delivers stunning 4K footage at 30 frames per second. And even by 2024 standards, the quality remains impressive. You get sharp details, vibrant colors, and the added bonus of able to extract high resolution stills from your 4K videos, offering versatility in your creativity. Uh, another great feature that keeps the G7 relevant is its free angle touchscreen. Whether you're shooting from high, low, or tricky angles, the flip out screen makes filming your shots effortless. It's also perfect for vlogging, selfies, in addition to its overall flexibility. Now let's talk a little bit about autofocus. While it has its quirks, especially in video mode, where it can occasionally lose focus, take a bit to find it, hunt a little bit. It might not lock on as fast as you like, but there is a fix, kinda. I found that using the Panasonic camera app on your phone to set the autofocus works best. Then switch to manual works wonders. It won't hunt. Connectivity is another area where the G7 shines. With the built-in Wi-Fi, transferring photos and videos to your smartphone or tablet is a breeze. So you can share them um, pretty much on social media, hassle-free. Plus, the Panasonic Image app, you can control your camera remotely, which will be a game changer, which helps me out a lot with my previous issue with autofocus. I use the app, let it autofocus, turn off autofocus, Turn it to manual, boom. So is the Panasonic G7 still worth it in 2024? Absolutely. It's versatile, reliable, and remains affordable for the most part. For both beginners and seasoned creators, it's 4K video capabilities, flexible touchscreen, and solid image quality. The G7 remains a valuable tool in anybody's photographer, video photographer's kit. That's why I still was holding on to mine. Uh, I'm not gonna let it go. It's a go-to for Pacific shots, like when I do reviews in my car or other tight spaces. I just slap it on a magic arm and I'm good to go. Thank you for watching. Hope you found the information in this video useful. If you did, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell and share this video with anyone who can benefit. But if I miss something, dislike this video and leave a comment letting me know what I did wrong. I welcome constructive criticism. Also, you can follow me on social medias at Tech Minute.